Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2017 with the Rude Man, and we're back on Corn Belt. And we've got a great demand going on, and I'm trying to figure out how to do it. Um, I'm thinking I can use the train system. Let me stop him. And let's get some things running here while I'm waiting. But I don't want to take too much time. The great demand was for potatoes. And if we look at the finances here, we do have quite a few potatoes. We can sell them for 400 at the bakery. It's 300 right now at Guterbanoff. Um, this stays constant. If we sell them here, like one load or so, and it's going to be down below that probably. It's going to affect it. These things are going down. This one stays constant. That's what makes a great demand uh, a good, a great, a great demand. They have a demand and they're willing to stick with the price. If I sold potatoes here, one or two truckloads would bring the uh, price down because you're overloading the market. So the best thing to do, even though you'd make a, a little bit more money here, it's only going to be for like one load. So I'm thinking that we'll just take everything to the... Uh, place that's got the great demand. Let's get this over to field 50. I don't know why I'm messing with grass. I should just head up to that great demand and get it done. Um, so close. I'll get this guy running and we'll do that. The potato guy should be running still. I think. Uh, somebody's blocked. Uh-oh. He's blocked. Really? Well, I'll check it in a second here. Well, it looks like uh, our crops might be ready here. Take a look at that in a second here. So we can move that potato harvester over to Field 49, if that's ready. Let's get us a course here. Grass field 50. And lower this thing. Lower the boom. Let this guy go. Alright, let's go find out what's wrong with that combine. Uh, he's just full. It says that he was blocked, but he's not really. He's just full. Alright, we can fix that. Those combines hold an awful lot. Let's see, he's behind me, isn't he? I'm lost. guy working again. He's not going to work very long because what I'm taking out isn't very much in the scheme of things. There he goes. All right, well, let's move on. Let's head to a train. Now, I've moved the train. I've moved the train back to the farm. This is our main farm uh, that had the grass in it, and I'm just going to un start unloading stuff here. So, where the heck am I? Let's unload the grass. And then we're going to load up potatoes because I think I think this train goes exactly where we need to go to sell the potatoes. I think. Could be mistaken, but we'll find out. Thank goodness this stuff unloads quickly. <laughs> I need a wider camera angle. Is it 
it empty? I guess so. Next one is straw. Next one or two is, and I went back to grass. Is it done? It's done. Okay. Oop. Wrong gas pedal. Alright, there goes that one. No, I got one more straw, and then we go back to grass. Maybe one. I don't think I did much beyond that. I didn't fill it up. I didn't fill every car up. Now, I thought it said that one of my silage silos was done fermenting, but it's they're not. They're still fermenting. I don't know what that was about. Now, is there another grass? I think there is. Yep. Actually, this doesn't take as long as I thought it would. It empties pretty quickly. Uh, Josh is full again. I think this is the last car. Last car. I think, I think, I think. Alright, we're where train is empty. Now, let's see if we can get those potatoes in here. Let me zoom in here a little bit and see what's going on. So, don't go too fast. Oh, I forget this thing does not stop easy. Okay, where's our... Shoot, is that it right there? Where's the offload chute? Is it here? Alright, let's start right there. We're gonna. Oh! Wait a minute! Where's it getting that? Is it getting it way back? Where does it load? Oh, there it is. I just didn't see it. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Go forward again. I just couldn't see it. It was behind that pillar. Okay, so it's right there. See the chute? All right, here we go. Let's do some potatoes. Well, that's filling up, though. Oh, shoot. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know. Which one am I on? I, I couldn't tell which vehicle I was sitting in. All right, what I want to do, though, is I want to get... Uh, this guy and get a load of potatoes. I don't want to sell all my potatoes. I want to I want to keep uh, just at least a, a truckload to get me by to make pig food. I don't have any pigs yet, but I will eventually. And I want to start making some pig food. I don't even have a, a pig mixer yet, but I want to get at least Oh, at least a truckload of potatoes. I 
I just want to make sure it's full. I'm afraid if I get out of it. Does it stop? No, it doesn't, so I should be okay. That's almost full. I'll wait. Alright, now let's go back to the tr train. Oh, I got that guy. Okay, let's go to the next car. And start. Now, did you notice the trigger came? The trigger showed. Oh, it's showing because of the unload one. Never mind. I can't figure out how the darn thing... It should show up when there's a car on the trigger, but... What a job, huh? See, I think the other thing that gets me is that there's uh, that's one car that we're looking at there, but there's a split in the middle there that makes it look like if you're just glancing that there's actually two cars there, but there's not. It's all one car. It's just split in the middle. So if you're if you're just kind of glancing at the train, it's a little deceiving as to how many cars you've got. All right, here we go. Now, I got a lot of potatoes, but I don't think there's as many as I actually thought there was. But, you know, I only, I only harvested one field. If I remember right. I, 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 that might be wrong. I might have leased a field, too. But one of my fields, 49, had potatoes on it. But I think I might have leased one, too. So that's, that's probably more accurate. Because that is a lot of potatoes. These fields are big, but they're not that big, are they? We got a, uh, not quite half. What I might do is stop at like a million and leave a little bit in there. I can't remember how much I actually had, but we're coming down fast. Might want to leave a few in there. We need corn. We don't have any corn. Or what? Well, now we've got uh, soybeans planted. We've got these planted. Let's see, what did we plant? We planted beets, soybeans, and sunflower seeds. Uh, I need corn. There's the trigger. Stop it. Stop, stop train. Okay, this might be the last load. I think it's what, what, 120 per trailer. And, well, maybe one more trailer. Or they're not trailers, they're cars, train car. Maybe one more. I want to leave some potatoes, I think. I think this is going to be a potato day. 
sound like a Canadian potato farmer. Another Canadian potato day. All right, uh, let's do another one. that brings it down to it's quiet in here <laughs> what am I gonna do it's quiet okay anytime Okay, it stopped. Now that's a little bit more than one uh, train car. Uh, I think a train car is 120. I think I'm going to keep that. Let's just head out. We didn't quite get a million, but that's okay. That's quite a bit of potatoes in the long run. Now let's see if we can get this heavy monster at getting to 117 miles an hour stopping it that's another thing we haw 117 we're cooking up the tracks whoa hang on it's a roller coaster ride holy smokes and we're gonna be passing through Oh, shoot. I should have put some... Oh, oh, I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking. Maybe I should while I'm this close. Hang on. I goofed. I was going to try to do two things at once. But we got a long ways to go. Because we have to go all the way down south. But, come on. Let me stop. Gee whiz. I forgot I was gonna put some canola yeah I was gonna put some canola yeah I was gonna put canola in there and take it to the refinery all right let's go back sorry we're not that far away at 117 miles an hour it's just stopping that's the problem but I need to take some canola and put it in the other train depot from the farm and then I can take the other train that goes down to the refinery and take canola and drop it off there there's one of my logs I gotta go pick those up oh man that was awful it's because I sped the train up I'm sure I'm just going to have to haul the logs with a truck. I don't need to log anyway, really. I just need pallets. And I've probably got enough logs already to get more pallets than I need. And you know, you can set the, uh, you can set the train on cruise control. So what I could do is uh, if I'm worried about driving too fast and if I'm worried about my foot being too heavy I could actually put it in cruise control and then drop the speed down as long as I'm going forward you can't do cruise control backward now this is normal speed for the train right here But who wants to do normal, huh? Okay, we've already went too far already. 
So let's stop. Go forward. Keep hitting the button until something pops. There. Stop. Where's my mouse? Darn it. Went too far. Okay, there's potatoes. Stop. Stop. All right, we want uh, the canola. Not very much. A couple of train our cars. But it's enough to get started on some uh, some refining, I think. I think. What do I know? I'm not an oil man. I don't live in Texas. Or Saudi Arabia, either one. There's one. Where's the other train car? There. Stop. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop at two train cars. I think I got a little bit more. That'll leave me just a tiny little bit if I need it. I don't know what I need it for, but it'll leave me a, a hair's worth. Maybe. Maybe. 240, here we come. 240. Now I gotta remember to stop at the next stop. I can't just buzz through it. Okay, that left us just a tiny little bit, 11,000. All right, let's hit, hit the road. Trailers for sale or rent. I'm king of the road, man. Like I said, I gotta remember to stop at this next depot and drop off the canoe. Well, I don't have to. I could, uh, I could come back and hit it on the rebound, but I'm there. Might as well do it, huh? Wouldn't that be awful if I started losing sugar beets and stuff out? It's just flying out the top. That was weird to watch those logs just go flying out of the darn train car. That's disappointing. There's one there. I don't know where the rest of them are. They, they've got to be around the train track, though, so it shouldn't be too hard to find. So that one there really flew. I mean, it just flew. Okay, I forgot to stop. Oh, jeez. I waited too long. Oh, I don't know where the rest of my logs are. I don't see them. I didn't see any more. Come on, brakes work. Come on. All right, I think I'm gonna be okay. Cause it's the, uh, it's the uh, canola I want to get rid of. So those are all potatoes. Pass the potatoes? I think so. I think I'm on empty cars right now, so I can go backwards until I hit. Oh, wait a minute. Green elevator. Back. Start. No, no, I don't want that. I don't want that. How am I going to tell? Maybe that little icon will show up when I get to a, a dump spot. 
I don't want to dump my potatoes. I haven't seen an icon yet. There. There. Is it dumping canola? It's dumping canola. Okay. So that's the that's the last trailer. So before that I was on empty. Okay, boy, that thing dumps pretty quick. So now just watch for the icon again. There. That should be the rest of the canola. Alright. You love it when a plan comes together? I do. Here we go. Hang on to your hats. 117 miles an hour halfway down the map. Takes a bit to get going, but we'll get there. We're going to go through a bunch of tunnels, too. That's kind of cool. It's disconcerting if you keep the camera up like this. Because you're going through solid rock. It's like, oh my god. If you keep it down, though, you can actually go through the tunnel and see what's going on. Or you can keep it all the way up, and the train disappears through the tunnel. Your choice. I'll move it back. Like this. Oh, jeez. I'm going to get sick. <coughs> First tunnel... Okay, so if we stay low like this, we go through the tunnel. If you do this, you're inside the tunnel. And if you go way up, you can actually think, get high enough. But that's no fun. We don't watch the train. All right, where are we now? Got to watch out because it goes too fast. Okay, see when I, there's a uh, there's a train stop up ahead here, and that's where I need to start slowing down. I think you can see the green thing in the sky. That's kind of where we're going. I set uh, a trigger thing over here, that that thing right there, that target thing. We hit the train depot. Nope, this is it right here. Let's start slowing down. Here it is, right here. It's a little staging area. Where your fields there. Ooh, that's a dark tunnel. Holy smokes. Whoa, freaky. All right, we'll get to slowing down here. If you start slowing down soon enough, it's not too bad. We're already going fat. We're still going faster than normal, though. Where's normal right there? About 48, 49. 50 miles an hour. That's normal speed. Okay, now there's the green thing, but that's fuel. So I don't know what that is, but I think this is where we need to dump right here. I think. And I think we can do it right from the train because this doesn't have a loading section, just an unloading. Even for the trucks over there. See, you don't see a chute for loading a truck, only for unloading. So I think it's just a sell point. I think. We'll keep our fingers crossed if I start dumping potatoes that I'm getting paid for it. All right, ready? Okay, here goes nothing. We're getting paid. All right. If you'd notice on the map down there, on the right, um, I don't know. I, this has got to be it because there's nothing to sell over there. Let me show you. This has got to be it. 
There's, this is the only place you can dump something. This over here is a petrol place. There's no... There's no... Th see what I mean? That's not potatoes. That's all this is, is a petrol place. So I'm just assuming that that's the place up here that we're selling at. That we're getting the price from. Hope, I hope, I hope. Alright. Let's get back on our train. And it's not like they sell for a good price. I mean, it's only $300 a ton. We're not going to make a whopping lot of, um, amount of money. We'll do okay, I guess. See, the icon comes up when you dump. And then when it's empty, the icon will go away. That's the only way to tell whether you're on a, a dump site or not. And there's really no way you can tell whether you're under a loading chute. See, now the icon went away. Okay. Did I miss something? to trigger there. I didn't get all that train car. Here we go. Alright. Dang train is really long. Everything's big on this map, including the train system. Look how many cars I got on there. It's just unbelievable. I could take some off, but what's the fun in that? Gotta think big. Wait till we get on that field 18, if we ever do. I don't even know how much that thing cost. I don't know if I want to know. Like a billion dollars. Who knows? Last one. Right, so we did make a whopping amount of money, but hey, better than kicking the nose. All right, home again, home again, jiggity jig. Woohoo! Here we go. Kick it up. Put some coal in that thing. So that was fun, huh? Now we got to uh, plant potatoes again. All right, we're up at full speed. I thought about kicking it up, but I don't want to get too crazy. Makes it a lot faster though. Gosh, before it just took forever. For those of you that are uh, curious, this is not a mod. To make the train go faster, you have to actually go into the, the uh, game. If you're playing Steam, you gotta go through Steam and you change the game. And there's a possibility that you could screw the whole game up. It's not like you can just take the mod out and everything's back to normal. Uh, you have to actually change it in-game. And uh, 
Also, if you do, it more than likely will make it so you can't play multiplayer. Uh, there's a great big warning when you go into the actual game that says don't mess with this. If you do, you're going to screw everything up. So I'm not going to show anybody how to do it. If you want to do it, you can figure it out. But I don't want to be responsible for messing somebody's game up. So a mod, that's a, that's another thing. A mod is another thing. Like I say, if you if you got a mod that's messing up, you just take the mod out. You didn't really hurt your game in most cases. But if you start messing around with the game itself, you could really do some damage to it. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take this back up to the train depot. See how quickly we got here? It wasn't too bad at all. It really makes a difference. All I did was just double what was in there, basically. But you got to remember it's in kilometers, so it doesn't actually... I mean, if it's miles per hour, you're doing 50. Uh, if you double it, it's 100. Kilometers is different. So you're actually changing kilometers, and it doesn't quite work the same way when you double it. Because normally I would only be doing 100, but I'm doing 117. I'm going to try to look carefully and see if I can see more of those logs. I don't know where they flew to. Maybe they're stuck up in the trees. I don't see them. I really don't. I don't know where they went. Oh, there's one right on the train track. Uh-oh, I didn't start stopping soon enough. <laughs> no, 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 no. Come on, come on, don't, don't, stop. Now see, the thing of it is I, I changed the speed, but I didn't change the brakes. All right, let me back this thing up. Come on. And there is no reverse, What, by the way. You got forward and, and uh, or I mean brake. There's no brake. You have forward and reverse. So to stop it if you're going backwards you have to hit the gas if you're going forward to stop it you have to hit reverse engines all right let's just get it back here closer to the front Alrighty, let's go get our uh, our sugar beets taken care of. Because that poor guy, he's been sitting here waiting for us. Wish there was a great demand for sugar beets. That'd be cool. Okay, Josh, I'm here. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give what you got. And then, I don't know whether I wasted my whole episode here selling those potatoes, but it was interesting. And I should check and see if my fields are ready to harvest, but I'm not going to start it in this episode. We'll start that in the next episode. And guess what? we got more sugar bees to do. Look at it. We'd have got a lot more if this field was fully uh, seeded, but it wasn't. Well, the train... Oh, jeez, that was a big bump. The train crossing should be clear now because I pulled that train back far enough. 
that the guards should be up. Yes, they are. So I don't have to drive across the railroad tracks this time. I do still have to go through this field, though. I don't have to, but I don't want to drive all the way up there and then back again. That's Santa silly. So, next episode, I'm going to try to get a pig uh, pig food mixer up. If I, I don't think I did yet. I don't think so. I did a cattle one. And we're just waiting for silage to make some cow food. Let's go see with we've got enterprises done so let's stop him and get him off the field we'll start that guy up over here he's already got a course that's good start him in this corner here and let him go about his business jump out and check this field over here it's only 71 percent you know I've never ever gotten a confirmation of whether if it's 71 percent but it's ready to harvest if I wait till it's a hundred percent do I get more yield this one's just uh, ready to go I think Let's see. Growth pattern. Uh, 49. Yeah, remove tops. It's ready. Okay. And then uh, 35. 35 is not done yet. It's still cooking. So we can wait a little bit further on that. <laughs> God, I don't know where my... <laughs> where did all my... Let's go to the railroad tracks and see if I can find my logs. Oh man, I really lost them, didn't I? Where in the heck did they all go? Did they go off the side? Oh, I just did. I fell off the side. See any logs? Oh man. Where could my logs go? That little spindly one is right there. That was the first one to go, I think. No? I don't know. I thought that was the first one to go. They gotta be here, don't they? How far could they have flown? Holy smokes. Where could they have went? Oh, that's just too weird. There's one. They're in the grass. So they're going to be kind of hard to find. And then I can't remember. I'd have to watch the video. Did they all go off the right side? Just, oh, God, that scared me. Well, shoot. I don't know where they're all at. I know that one just flew forever. All righty, then. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to end the episode here. And hopefully in the next episode we'll start some kind of harvest. Hope you had fun. If you did, give it a like, share it with a friend, subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you back on Corn Belt in the next episode. In the meantime, 
y'all have fun farming. <laughs>